Now to Project Drive Safer and a major pivot from the state. The Wisconsin Department of Transportation today announcing late this afternoon that everybody who goes through driver's ed will soon need to take a road test. Waivers out of that test, they end in December. Ben Jordan's been following developments on the road test waiver all year long. He joins us now to explain just how big this announcement by the state is, Ben. Yeah, Steve, this is a very big deal, especially for 16 and 17 year olds. For the past three and a half years, WISDOT data shows nearly 90% of all Wisconsin teens who completed driver's ed were allowed to skip their road test at the DMV. In total, Wisconsin says more than 140,000 parents or guardians signed a waiver allowing their kids to bypass that test. The Department of Transportation says the program was put in, in place in response to the pandemic. Wisconsin is one of just four states that still have this waiver in place. Today's announcement is an interesting development because Wistot told me earlier this year that it was their hope to make this waiver permanent. In order for that to happen, the Wisconsin legislature needed to approve the plan, and that never happened. In lieu of the road test, Wistot increased the number of hours students need to be behind the wheel with their parents from 30 to 50 hours in order to get their license. Beginning on January 1st, teens who complete driver's ed will be required to prove they have the driving skills at the DMV to get their license, just like adults do who don't take driver's ed. I reached out to Wistot to request an interview on this development, which they declined. Steve. Back to pre-pandemic normal. Ben Jordan, thank you for that. A reminder, for our final month of the Project Drive Saver campaign, we're launching Adopt a Driver. Your donations will help pay for driver's ed for teens who otherwise couldn't afford it. If you'd like to adopt a driver, scan the QR code on your screen. You can also head to projectdrivesafer.com.